CompTIA A Plus Core 2, 220-1102, Practice Exam. Questions 126 through 130. This video is part of our practice exam video series and is filled with questions that closely resemble the real exam. So are you prepared to test your knowledge? Great, let's begin. Question 126. A network engineer at a large company is tasked with diagnosing intermittent connectivity problems affecting internal servers. Employees are experiencing frequent disconnections and unstable network performance. Which of the following command line tools should the engineer use to gather the most comprehensive data for analysis? The answer is D. Path ping. Path ping is a powerful diagnostic tool that combines the functionality of ping and traceroute. It provides detailed information about network latency and packet loss along each step from the source to the destination, making it ideal for identifying problematic network segments. This comprehensive data helps in pinpointing where the network issues are occurring. Question 127. A technology firm is upgrading its office with advanced video conferencing systems in every meeting room. Which of the following network types would most likely be impacted in this situation? The answer is B. LAN. Installing advanced video conferencing systems in multiple rooms will increase the demand on the local area network, or LAN, within the office. This network type connects devices within a limited area, such as a building, and will need to be able to handle the increased data traffic from the new equipment. Question 128. A company technician is tasked with configuring advanced system settings on multiple Windows workstations. To streamline the process, the technician needs to ensure they have permanent administrator access on each machine. Which of the following Windows tools should be used to accomplish this task? The answer is A. Local Users and Groups. The Local Users and Groups tool in Windows is used to manage user accounts and groups. By adding a user account to the administrator's group, a technician can grant themselves permanent administrator access, allowing them to make system changes without needing to elevate permissions repeatedly. This tool also allows for the creation, deletion, and modification of user accounts and groups providing comprehensive control over user permissions and access levels. Question 129. A technician is helping a user troubleshoot a problem on their Mac OS computer. To effectively assist the user, the technician needs to view the user screen simultaneously. Which of the following default system tools can the technician use in Mac OS for this purpose? The answer is C. Screen sharing. Screen sharing is a built-in tool in Mac OS that allows users to share their screen with another person. This feature enables a technician to view and control the user's screen in real time, facilitating efficient troubleshooting and support. It eliminates the need for additional software and provides a seamless way to assist users remotely by leveraging the native capabilities of the operating system. Question 130. A user notices that their Windows 10 computer is taking a long time to boot up due to multiple applications starting automatically. Which Windows built-in utility should they use to manage and disable these startup applications? The answer is B. Task Manager. In Windows 10, the management of startup applications was moved from the System Configuration tool to the Task Manager. The Task Manager now includes a dedicated Startup tab where users can enable or disable programs that run at startup. This change provides a more user-friendly and integrated approach to managing system performance and processes all within the Task Manager utility. So, did any of these questions give you a tough time? Don't worry if they did, it's all part of the learning process. Luckily, Certification Synergy has a wealth of free video content at your disposal. To stay connected with our latest IT learning resources, just give a quick click on the subscribe button. This simple action ensures you're always updated about our newest video releases.
Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.